Hey everybody, we're at the Kenton Corner Shopping Center yet again. Where the Slow's Foods has been vacant for probably four or five years about. But no, we're not here to see the vacant Lowe's Foods. If you guys have watched my videos for a while, you may recognize that rundown Shinar 330A. It's possessed. Yes, it's possessed. I've done two videos of this thing in the past and I have failed to capture something kind of weird that it does. It does it after you ride the elevator. You go up and down, you get off, it does something kind of weird. No, it's not the re-leveling that it does. It does something else. Let's ride it and see what it does. You should base it 2002 Schindler. Look how faded that call button is. Look at that, that was white at one time. This your basic cab, sits for a while. I almost thought it wasn't going to make it. <laughs> because these things, you know, the controllers do time out after a certain amount of time. If it doesn't reach a floor in time, it'll time out. And then you're stuck. Down there is my GMC Nolly road bike. On this beautiful March evening. It's in the 60s out here. I'll definitely accept the warmer than average weather. It's supposed to hang around for a while. Again, there is the abandoned shopping center. Yeah, this little section of Kenton Corners hasn't done very well. It's sort of like the elevator hasn't been doing too well. I mean, the thing barely moved. You could, it did not actually feel like it was moving very fast. You notice how long it took to level. Yeah. Go to one. It did pass inspection recently though. And there's that re-leveling it does every time. Level has leveling issues. Let's take one more ride, see how it does the second time around. I believe this has been sitting for a while is what it is. See how it rides this time. Either this thing, um, either it's having a lot of issues, like friction-wise, having a hard time going up, or it's just that slow. Even for Schindler standards, that thing takes forever to level. But let's go back down and show you what it's going to do. Mind you, it does it after. It does it after you get off at the first floor. And the 
re-leveling every time. But no, that's not the that's not how the elevator is possessed. Wait for it. I'm not gonna say that's it because it's not it just yet. Let's let it close. And let's sit here and wait a minute. I'll just keep recording the whole time. There's some manpower elevator for those those who care. Let's wait for it. It's done this the past two times I've shot video of this thing. This didn't do it while shooting video. Let's wait for it. Any moment now. Watch it not do it this time because I'm actually still recording. I could show you some other things right here, but I'm going to keep this camera at the elevator. <clears throat> See guys, this Schindler is possessed. I did not press the call button, mind you. It just, you know, just sitting there. It randomly opens its door and answers like an up call. The button is not jammed. No, that's not an issue at all with the button. It's just possessed. This 330A is possessed. It only does that one time. After you ride it and get off of it, it only does it one time. Afterwards, it'll just sit there and not do anything. There you, there you have it, guys. The possessed Schindler 330A. Hope you guys enjoyed it.